Today we look at the magic career of Howard Wright. After a four-year college career at Stanford, Wright declared for the 1989 NBA draft but wasn't selected and spent a year honing his skills before signing as a free agent with the Atlanta Hawks prior to the 1990-91 season. The Hawks had a stacked front line that included Moses Malone, Dominique Wilkins and Kevin Willis and after four games of limited playing time behind them, Wright was waived. The Magic liked the look of the burly young big man and in November they waived Mark McNamara to make room for Wright on the roster before a West Coast road trip. Coach Matt Gukas turned to Wright immediately in his first game against the Warriors, playing him 24 minutes as he almost had a double-double with 9 points and 10 rebounds. Five days later in Los Angeles, Greg Kite was in foul trouble and Wright played 30 minutes and scored 13 points. In December, Mark Akers moved back ahead of Wright in the rotation and in his eighth game for the Magic, which were all losses, Wright collided with Portland's Buck Williams, spraining his ankle and bruising his knee. Around the same time as Wright got injured, Sam Vincent strained his hamstring and the Magic needed a roster spot to re-sign Morlan Wiley to back up Scott Skiles. Wright, unfortunately, was the odd man out and was waived to make room. Not long after, Dallas signed Wright to a 10-day contract and he played three games for them, including one against the Magic less than a month after Orlando had waived him. After the season, Wright signed with the Nuggets as a free agent, but he never played for them, and once he was waived, he headed to Europe, playing in Spain, France and Italy. After time in Europe and the CBA, the Magic brought back Wright for a second run during the 1992-93 season. Initially, he was signed in October, but he was waived before the season even started. In April 1993, Terry Catledge was placed on the injured list and Wright was signed as a third-string big man to try and help as the team scrambled to make the playoffs. He got garbage time minutes in four games. His best outing was against the Celtics where he put up eight points in just six minutes of play. After the season, Wright headed back to Europe where he played out the decade in leagues in Spain and then in Japan before retiring. In Wright's 12-game Magic career, he averaged 4.3 points and 3.3 rebounds per game. I hope you enjoyed this look at the magic career of Howard Wright. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and check back soon for a look at the magic career of Greg Kite.